Hi, Bridge Church. I'm here with Tyler. Uh, Tyler's going to be joining our staff team in July, and I'm really looking forward to that. I've had the opportunity to get to know him uh, quite a bit over the last six to eight months or so, and we've had a great time connecting and talking about life and ministry. And Tyler, uh, I, it's been great to get to know you, but tell the church just a little bit about uh, a little bit about yourself. Sure. Uh, <clears throat> it's not a ton to know. I grew up in this little tiny town called Kingsville. Um, it's near Windsor, if that resonates with anybody. It's kind of a big auto industry, which is kind of where I got my start with interest in cars. Uh, other than that, it's like anything to get active. I'm into basketball being the first love, as you can share in, which is so fantastic. Are you going to... Are you gonna let me dunk on you? Uh, you can try. You, you, definitely you, you heard him say that. I, I can try. So yeah. we'll see how that goes. I'll, I'll wait and we'll see what happens. All right. Give me a running start. Get the That's charge. All. Yeah. Um, other than that, I love music. Uh, play drums. Um, I'll listen to anything that's well done. Um, Even country music? Well, that's why I said anything well done. Oh, okay. And you just can't. You can't Good. do that well. We can disclaimer that, right? Um, we can just cut that out. Maybe if there's too many in the in the congregation, but <clears throat> I just can't do it. But I, I do love music. It's fantastic. Um, but after coming out of Kingsville, um, I went down to the Greater Toronto area. Um, actually, became an engineer, which was all kinds of fun. Just for something to do, just, or you know, it's just a good time. You know, it's, it's cool that it's fun. You it's just cool accumulate day. it just because you want it. Um, worked as an engineer for about a year before I called the ministry, um, and then went and I've been at St. Paul's here in Ottawa, and just uh, been working with Jeremy, which you may have met yet or not. You'll see, but he's a wonderful dude, uh, and it's just been an absolute pleasure and a journey to be there, but I'm excited to be here and at the church um, and see what you guys are all about um, and what you're heading towards, and I'm just excited to be a part of it. Fantastic. So uh, Tyler's going to be coming in to oversee our student ministries department, and uh, as we've mentioned uh, in the Carpool series, that's a, a huge part of, of who we are and wanting to connect with students. And and Tyler, tell us a little bit about um, how student ministry, you mentioned you, were, you started out as an engineer, you sensed a call to ministry. Tell us a little bit about that and also how the student ministry is really, you know, in your heart. Well, it's <clears throat> kind of been interesting over time to see how God has place me in different youth ministry atmospheres, whether it be my own upbringing, but even as I was kind of floating around the GTA doing engineering, he kept continuing to open doors um, into different youth ministries and getting in contact with different youth right, pastors right. that had, had a great effect on my life and being able to see and model those things and he just became to kind of grow a heart in me for student ministry as a whole um, and just the way that it benefited me and the way that I hope to be able to bless other people. Um, I'm excited to be doing it at the bridge in particular because the way that I see youth ministry working out is very much in line with the, the way that you guys, um, you, the way that you look at doing ministry, like your vision going forward as far as building bridges to you know unchurched and de people. Um, <clears throat> I mean, that, I, that in itself is something that I've always longed to be a part of a church sure. that is all, all about reaching unreached people. Um, and I think it's the um, kind of the example that Christ has set for us and the fact that um, he sacrificed himself on a cross for the sake of us having a relationship with God. And mm -hmm. I think that's what this church has been all about is the idea that you take your resources, your preferences, your, you know, comfortable social circle and all the rest of it, and you sacrifice that to love and care about other people. So I'd love to do that within the youth ministry as well. Um, I know there's been some turnover over the past couple of years. And, it's tough to invite people into that space, but hopefully bring some consistency in there um, and allow people to know that when they come, it's going to be a loving and caring community. Um, all the students out there, I'm sure you guys all know people um, that need Jesus and um, you want to be able to bring them into a space that you know is going to be fun and that you actually want to bring them out to, not yeah, just like yeah. maybe I'll sh right. shoulda, coulda, coulda. <laughs> yeah. um, and then be able to experience and wrestle with the bigger questions in a safe place. Most of us wrestle with those for so long, doesn't matter you know, teenage or young adult or adult, if we don't create a space to have an open dialogue about these things, um, then they just kind of fester. So yeah. we want to be able to answer some of those big questions and wrestle with them I mean, in a place where you just feel cared for. Um, so that's my hope and that's where my heart's always been. Awesome. Well, I'm really looking forward to uh, to having Tyler on the team and, and for our students to, to connect with him, our student leaders uh, to connect with him. And, and I think that he's going to bring some great vision and direction to this area of, of our ministry. And uh, so Tyler, I'm really looking forward to that and uh, everything that's going to happen. I can juggle and I actually enjoy it. I'm pretty sure that I can beat Scott one-on-one -on -one in basketball. 
I cannot stand country music. I was born and raised to loathe it, and I'm okay with that. I have actually been moving piano since I was like 11. My dad moves tunes and refinishes them. I know way too much about pianos. It's very weird. There's actually a videotape out there of me as a two-year-old falling in a toilet. <laughs>